Colossians chapter 3, verses uh, 1 through 4 reads as follows. If ye then be risen with Christ, seek those things which are above, right, right, right. where Christ sitteth on the right hand of God. Amen. Number two, set your affections on things yeah. above, All right. not on things yeah. on the earth. Yeah. For ye are dead, and your life is hid with Christ in God. Yeah. Yeah. Number four, when Christ, who is our life, shall appear, then shall ye also appear with him in glory. May the Lord add a blessing to the readers, hearers, and doers of his holy word. Father, we come this morning, no shape, form, or fashion. We come recognizing, Father God, that it wasn't by our own power that we even got up off of our bed. Lord, you spoke our names, and Lord, we heard your call. Here we are, your humble servant. Lord, we come right now to open up your word which is a life to us. Yes. It is a lamp unto our feet. It is a light unto our path. But Father God, some of us have neglected your word. So you've given us the opportunity this Sunday morning to break open your word, mm -hmm. to read from heaven's gates, and Father God, to understand what you would say to the church today. Yes. Someone said, may our hearts burn with Lord, I don't come eloquent, but Lord, I am as simple as I know how. Hide me behind the cross of Calvary. Lord, we ask right now that the blood of Jesus Christ not cover me, but cover all, that someone's heart may be changed. I pray, Lord, if there's someone here that doesn't know you in the pardon of their sin, they don't have the hope that we have with them. that they leave here, yes. they will begin to sing, yes. heaven is my home. Yes. Lord, we thank you. Thank you, Lord. It brings tears to our eyes because our struggles ain't so hard. Yes. In Jesus' name, I do pray. Amen. 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 He sees the potential in me. Yes. He sees the potential in me. You're looking at that and saying, where, where did you get that from, preacher? He sees the potential in me. As we look at Eve in Colossians chapter 3, I went through and I studied the book of Colossians. I've been dealing with it for a little while. And what got me to this point, if you have your Bible still open, look at Colossians chapter 2, verse 10. Right. Colossians 2, verse 10 says, And ye are complete in him, which is the head of all principality and power. All right. Sit with that just for a second. Right. And ye are complete. How complete are we? How many of yeah. you feel yeah. really complete? Right. <laughs> How many of you feel like life is just beating you up? How many of you feel like the job is just grabbing every fiber of your being? Oh, no. How many of you feel like you have so much going on in your marriage? Yeah. This marriage is supposed to be easy, but every time I look around, I gotta adjust. How many of you feel like what's going on in my neighborhood, there's shooting going on, there's killing going on? How many of you feel <coughs> People talk about you, and by the time it gets around to you, the story has been so distorted that you don't know the full truth of yourself. <coughs> Some saved carnal 
eternal home. Yeah, we are going to be raptured Amen. out of here in the twinkling of an eye. But how many of you really feel like as a Christian right now, you feeling like you're living in the kingdom of God? <coughs> I understand where I'm going with this thing. All right, all right. By the time the job has beaten you down, by the time the boss tells you, I need more of you, you don't quite feel like you are risen with Christ. Uh, I mean, you got confused at all. I wouldn't raise my hand if I was you. <laughs> the computer, the, the, the technological advancement of our society has made it so easy for the children of God Watch yourself, uh -huh, to fall into Right now, Lord, you seem to be so far away. You seem 